Hey guys, Eric Sue here. Hope you're doing well. Welcome back to another episode of Goality Lifestyle. Today's going to be a fun one because today I'm going to be talking about this thing right here. It's the indoor outdoor digital HD TV antenna. So stay tuned. All right, you guys, so I'm back and this is my 55 inch LG OLED uh, CX PUA TV and I got it connected to an older antenna right here and it's the one by one it's a few years old and um, we thought we get a update to the antenna situation for this 4k TV and we got the um, digital HD TV antenna to replace this one hopefully uh, it works better and stronger signal now this one right here you can see gets uh, quite a few channels starting at two uh, in our local area in Chicago and you can see um, there goes all the way to 66 and has all these um, in between channels here so um, I forget the number of channels in total but it goes up to 66 with all these other uh, in between channels um, it's probably not exactly 1 through 66, so 66 plus, um, but in general it's about 66, or I should say about 50 or more channels in total. If, if I had to put it all together, um, it's up in that range um, with this one by one indoor uh, antenna that we have. And um, the signal is as good, sometimes it drops, and that's why we wanted to get this replacement. And so I'm going to go ahead and hook up the new one and um, see what kind of channels we got uh, in addition to the signal. Now, the, the new one that I uh, received is this one right here. And um, what's cool about this one, and by the way, it's the model CJH-358A, okay? And we're gonna hook this up, see if we're gonna get additional channels. If not, that's fine, but at least we wanna get a stronger signal. Um, than the one that we have currently. Now, this one comes with a 32.8 foot uh, cable. So if we wanted to extend this thing out away uh, from this TV and to the outside, we could. Um, let me just give you a little uh, um, close. Uh, let me just give you a idea of where things are. So our TV is like right here. And if you just pan over, that's the old one and then our, our windows are over here. So it's gonna give us enough length, if we wanted to, to hang it outside, which is a really cool feature. Okay, so um, I'm gonna go ahead and hook this up, do a scan, and see if we get more channels. If not, that's cool, like I said. The main idea here is that we get a stronger signal so our TV channels don't drop. So as you can see, we did the scan in on the antenna. Uh, DTV it has 81 channels found, and um, LG channels it has 338 channels. LG channels are like those. I believe the um, uh, the TV itself has built-in channels, so um, 338 found. So that's really cool. And um, let's just see how it looks. Okay. Let's go into TV. Okay, looks pretty good. Okay, this is one of our channels. Not too bad, right? And so um, let's go into the guide again. Okay. And let's go and see. Still have all these channels. You can see all through in here. Um, see up to 66 that's true okay the same number of channels pretty good so um, I'd say that I think for getting the number of channels I think it's pretty similar um, we can do another scan with the old one and see if, how it compares however the main thing that we're looking for here is the signal and the signal plus um, not dropping 
um, the picture when you know bad weather happens or something like that, then it gets re really um, the, um, the 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 signal gets a little bit shaky. So um, we're gonna um, test this out and see how it goes. Um, for the most part, um, it looks pretty strong and um, everything looks pretty good according to what I'm seeing right now, okay? Um, again, some of the things that I wanna say that this unit comes with is that it comes with a stand that you can use. Um, so it looks something like this and um, it just connects right on the back of this unit, right back in here. And so you can use it as a stand, okay? Something like that. And um, it also comes with um, screws that if you wanted to um, mount it onto the outside, you could do that. And those are the um, hardware that comes with this antenna. So far, so good. It, it, it seems to be working, that it picked up the signal uh, and the channels. And uh, all of the other thing is that it has short range, short range and long range um, power. So um, ampl it's an amplifier switch. And so if they say if you are about 25 to 35 miles away from the signal tower, they recommend using the short range amplifier or position. And if you are far away, like more than 35 miles away from the signal tower, then you recommend using the long range position, okay? So um, you can always um, find out where your uh, house is or location is relative to this to the towers by going on the website and just find, um, I think you can search um, uh, signal towers and then you can put uh, your information in that website and you can um, determine how far you are. Okay, um, so as far as setup goes, very easy. Um, just plug it, plugging it into the back of your TV and then um, uh, searching for the, for the um, channels on, on the TV itself. Okay, so um, that is my review so far. I may have to do a follow-up to see how the signal strength is in um, bad weather around our area, but um, so far so good. Looks pretty easy to set up as you can see and um, we like it so far. Well, at least I like it so far. All right, so if you guys like this video, remember to destroy the like button, subscribe button, and notification button to help the YouTube algorithm, and also you can get future videos from me, and um, we'll see you in the next one. Bye.